every year in college year, there's some hoaxes and like I guess somebody, some fraternity called some some cats some, the N word, and they got all frizzied up. And you know, I, I seen a guy tweet, and he said he went to Syracuse, and he said that's why we don't go no we don't go there no more. Well, we went there, blacks home with blacks, white homeless whites, and just like we told you, I'm like, mm. what is your what's the problem? <laughs> like, I, don't, I don't I don't get it, man. I did. I just don't get it. Man. I, I don't get like why some of these cats want to be included in everything. Yeah, you know, they'll they'll scream this black pro black I'm black, this that and the third. But as soon as the white man say, "Okay, you're black," well, stay your black ass over there. Now they got a problem with it. Mind right. you, they're not doing anything to them. They're just hanging with the other themselves. Right. I mean, you know, it, it just it just makes no sense because they want to talk the black struggle and all this stuff we went through, and it was segregation. <laughs> and Hotep said segregation was good. We said it from the gate. Stay with your black self. <laughs> the white man's ice ain't colder. But no, y'all wanted to follow behind Martin. Y'all follow behind Martin. Y'all got integrated. Now y'all talking about y'all want to be integrated no more. Y'all got to make up your mind. You know, I'm not here to struggle for somebody that went to Syracuse University. That shit costs like 60 a year. This is some something crazy, man. Yeah. You were lucky to be there. <laughs> nigga, are you serious? I'll write nigga on the wall for him. <laughs> <laughs> my first day of school, I'm alright. My nigga. <laughs> right on the bathroom wall. I'm here now. Like. You should be happy you're at Syracuse, this privileged university. Most of us end up at community college. And it's on the bathroom wall. You ever been to New York or see what's written on the bathroom wall? <laughs> like, you know, I could understand if they started marching with KKK hoods on or something like that. You know, it started, you know, burning crosses in front of your dorm or something like that. But it's just something that was written on it. So now we have to say there's a possibility of a hoax, right? Yeah. But forget all that. Let's go to the nitty gritty, right? Uh, November 7th, 2019. The bathrooms in day hall floors four and six were vandalized with racist slurs and graffiti that targeted black and Asian students. Light fixtures were broken, vandalized and placed in toilets. All right. So some lights and some 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 markers, right? 11, 13, 5, 30 p.m. Uh, derogatory graffiti targeting the Asian community was found in the physics building. 11, 14, uh, a swastika was found drawn in the snow near 505 Walnut. So, so far, only 33% of these incidents were the black community. 11, 14, Day Hall floor three was vandalized with racist graffiti targeting Asian community. So now we got 25% <laughs> is black, right? Let's continue. 1116 Haven Hall was vandalized with uh, graffiti towards Asian community. Now we're down to 20%. Report of swastika graffiti in Haven Hall where a student yelled racial slurs targeting African Americans. Now we're back to 25%. A large group of individuals, uh, Alpha Hall, Chiro, uh, verbally attacked African American using N word. All right, so what we know is Asians was involved and uh, the Jewish community was involved. Now, when we go to the picture of the sit in, I don't see no Asian people around. <laughs> <laughs> you want to know why? Because they're studying their math homework. <laughs> I was on top of that bullshit. One thing I say is, you know, you know, Syracuse, New York, you know, it's it's a different environment for I think a lot of these black kids, you know, they come from like cities and this is their first time around really around white folks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know if they're getting intimidated or you know, um this is their defense mechanism or something like that. I don't I don't know. Um but it <laughs> they're doing too much, man. If it was that such a, that big of a problem, they should have went to a different school. Right. Should have went to HBCU. 